It's been a rather cloudy Friday and chilly at that as we're only at 44 degrees at this hour and that is not going to be changing anytime soon. A little bit of a breeze out of the northwest at 21 that will let up a little bit tonight and then return again for your Saturday. But for now, chilly all around, mostly 30s and low to mid 40s and that north and northwest wind are uh, making it feel chillier, sustained between 15 to 25 miles per hour. Can we expect any decreasing wind? Well, yes, a little bit later on tonight, but as we go into your Saturday afternoon, notice by lunchtime we start to see more or feel more uh, 25 to 30 mile per hour gusts across north central North Dakota. Once again, it subsides on Sat Sunday morning, making way for at least milder conditions for the second half of your weekend. But if you have travel plans, not really much is going to change anywhere in the Peace Garden State. Sunday is going to be the better day of the weekend. But then notice the wind does pick back up again on Monday. The lower 48 states, we've got severe weather in the central part of the nation. Severe thunderstorm watch for portions of Kansas at this time until midnight. And we've got some isolated strong severe thunderstorms popping up right now um, just over Imperia um, for the time being. That will stay in effect for now until at least 630. But here at home, we've got the cloud cover and notice moisture in South Dakota that is racing towards the northeast and that is going to bring a chance for some showers across eastern North Dakota for later on tonight. Your weekend hour by hour calling for breezy conditions for Saturday. Notice a cloudy start for the first half of your weekend, but we start to see a few breaks in that as we go into the afternoon. So it's not going to be a completely cloudy Saturday by the second half of the day. We should at least be seeing more sunshine. Definitely sunny for your Sunday, starting out around 28 degrees for church services Sunday morning, and then we'll be rising back up into the 50s for your Sunday afternoon. So that sunshine and lighter wind is going to be helping. Now, however, on the other note, we will have to talk about a developing storm system. For now, the storm system is well off in the Pacific, but there could be enough energy to produce some moisture later on next week with maybe the potential for some snow. It's still a ways out, so not much data as far as where the temperatures are going to be, let alone how much snow is going to be falling. But if we do get any snow, you'll notice that those chances are only at 10 to 20% for now. But we'll keep an eye out for that, and we'll be keeping an eye out on the next six to 10 days because not only are we expecting below normal temperatures, low, for, uh, low 40s to low 50s, we're also expecting some moisture in the forecast and so you're going to notice that breezier days ahead rain chances come in the second half of your Tuesday and really ramp up for Wednesday, Thursday and Friday of next week. Maybe a little bit of snow mixed in, but mainly rain showers, breezier conditions and becoming chilly next Wednesday. Joe highs are only going to be back in the 40s. All right, thank you so much, Henry.